Hello everybody, welcome back to Baking Budgets y'all. Today is going to be my last cash stuffing for the month of April. So let's just go ahead and jump into it guys. I'm going to be stuffing a total of $1,239. So let's just get right into it guys. I am a 24 year old cash stuffer based here in Washington state and I'm married and I'm just out here living with my husband and our kids and our dog as well. So if any of that sounds like it's interesting to you uh please consider subscribing and following along so today we're going to get started in my bills binder i have my prop money here as soon as we finish with my bills binder i will go ahead and take out my real money i just like to use prop money when i'm doing my bills it just makes it a lot easier for me um, to keep everything in the bank so phone bill today is going to be getting 26 dollars so 20 25 and 26 and i'm gonna see if we can condense any of this in any way i'm sure we can so we will take a look so we have now a total of 50 70 90 95 100 1 2 3 and 4 so $104 and that's why also I love using prop money is I can go ahead and swap it out whenever I want and that just makes it a lot easier for myself too and I am let me see find my black pen I'm gonna go ahead and let's see fill out my tracker what is today okay mm, or okay actually never mind I'm not gonna fill out my trackers in this in this video because I think it's gonna take forever so that's okay <laughs> okay so we have 104 in my phone bill next is insurance this is for our cars i am going to be adding 69 dollars so 50 60 65 66 67 68 and 69 so i can already see we can condense some here okay perfect so we have 50 100 and we have okay let me just go so 100 110 120 25 30 31 32 33 34 35 and 36 so 136 so 120 30 35 and 6 whoops Honestly, and the reason why I always like condense it when I can, so $136 in insurance um, is because it just makes it easier for me to, um, to count everything. Okay, perfect. Next is Netflix. And I did mention in my last video that I had added my parents on my Netflix. So I'm stuffing extra this time. And the reason that I am is because um it changed like the due date of my bill so it's going to be due in a couple days so that's why i'm stuffing it extra so we currently have 15 and i'm going to be adding 16 so we'll have 31 so 20 31 and that is what my new bill will be it'll be like 30 not uh 30 and some change so i just stuffed to the nearest dollar next is electric and gas and we're going to be adding 45 and we currently have 45 so we'll have 190 so 100 150 170 and 190 and i actually just saw that this bill hit today so i will be pretty much taking this out today once i make that payment next is a gym membership it is going to be getting nine dollars and in here we have 20 25 26 27 28 29 so 29 plus 9 we'll have 38 so 20 30 35 36 37 and 38 dollars in gym membership which is perfect this is how much it costs next is spotify and we currently have in here four dollars and we'll be adding five so spotify now has nine and i also just paid this so this is half of the payment for next month next is my loan and in here we have 75 and we'll be adding 75 
So that'll be $150 that I have in my loan. And that is half. And then next I have Toyota. This is for my husband's car payment. And in here, oops, we have 250 and we're going to be adding 250. So that'll be 500. So one, two, three, four, and 500 in Toyota. Perfect. And last but not least, we have rent. And in rent, we have 150 and I'll also be adding 150. So we'll have 300. So one, two, and $300 in rent. Okay, perfect. That'll do it for my bills binder. And I just have my special bills envelope back there if I get any special bills. Okay, perfect. So next what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and just take all this prop money away. And I will go ahead and take out my real money here. And everything is all kind of out of order so let me go ahead and organize this i hope you guys have been doing well i can't believe like it's already the end of another month but i just feel like we always say that like do you guys feel like we always say that we're always like oh i can't believe it's the end of another month but like really it's so crazy the month just flies by oh my goodness and then it's like we're really gonna be in summer like officially in summer Okay, guys, let's get into my pink binder. And here I just have some sinking funds categories. And I think we're only going to be stuffing two categories today. I was going to be stuffing my husband's haircut, but he already went and had his haircut today. So he took that money from here. So the only two things we're going to be stuffing is going to be Lychee's Emergency. I wanted to go ahead and stuff a $5 in there for him. So this is not like for his food or anything. His food just comes out of our groceries. Um, and then baby shower, I want to go ahead and stuff $5 as well. Kind of get the ball rolling on this. I kind of have already, my husband and I kind of already talked about it, that for our baby shower, I'll just be using the money from my um, 5000 challenge. Um, but I just kind of want to get the ball rolling a little bit, stuff a little bit um. Yeah, so that's what I did there. <laughs> and then next, you guys, as you know, <laughs> I will be going into my 100 envelope challenge because I told you guys in my last videos, I'm really trying to um, just get this one out of the way. We really want to finish it. So that is why I am going to be pretty much stuffing the rest into our 100 envelope challenge. I just want to make sure you guys have a good view of this. So let me... Let me just move up the money a little bit. Okay, perfect. So we're going to be doing today 92, 93, and 94. So that is really exciting. I'm going to be hitting more of the high numbers today. And like, that's the only thing is like, obviously, when you do like the high numbers, you only get to stuff like a couple envelopes. But you know what? That's totally fine. Because just imagine when it comes time to stuffing like the lower numbers, oh, it's going to feel like I get to stuff so many envelopes. So let's get started with 92. So 50, 70. Oh, this is an old one. Uh, 90, 91, and 92. So 50, 70, 90, 91, and 92 dollars. Oops. Oh, my man. So, oops. Okay, hold on. Oh my gosh, guys, recently what I've been obsessed with, well, honestly, it's kind of like phases. Like, do you ever get like, um, like you kind of like get obsessed with like a food and then you're just like, you keep eating it. And so you get tired of it and then you get tired of it. And then you're like, yeah, I'm kind of done eating it. Uh, but <laughs> hold on, wait, I'm trying to find my Sharpie. Where did I put it? Oh my gosh. Oh, okay. Right here. Right now, my current obsession is a strawberry Sprite from Sonic. Oh my gosh, it's so good. That's what I have over here in my flask so I could be nice and cold. Okay, so I did 92. And then last but not least, we'll be doing 93 and 94. Oh, and I don't know if I mentioned this in my last video, but this binder, you guys. So 50, 70, 90, 91, 92, 93. 
50, 70, 90, 91, 92, 93. Um, but this binder, you guys, I found it on Amazon um, and it was like $8.99. So it was super cheap and it came with all of these um, envelopes. And honestly, as you guys can see, like there, I'm stuffing quite a few denominations in here and this bugger is holding on. So it's doing pretty good. It, I think it's pretty sturdy if I do say so myself. So I can definitely see myself using this challenge multiple times in the future. And this binder is just like any of the other binders, like these ones I got from Amazon. They are so awesome, really, really good quality. And I mean, you know, you pick up your binders, you know, once every other week or whatever. So it's not like they're going through like anything crazy that they have to be super durable anyways. But um, yeah, I really like it. So if I don't end up doing the 1000 envelope challenge, like, Again, after this, I can totally use this binder like as a planner, like I'll get like sheets for it. I think that will be awesome. And last but not least, I'll be doing number 94. So 50, 70, 90, 91, 90, 93 and 94 50 70 90 91 92 93 94 and once again guys this is so crazy last week in my video i had ten dollars left over and once again i had ten dollars left over is that that's so crazy is that so crazy what in the world okay anyways that once again i'll just be tossing that in my wallet um to just have some change so yeah, like what? What am I doing wrong? I was mis miscounted the same way twice, but that's okay. Okay, here we go. Oh my goodness. Perfect. 94. Awesome. Okay, guys. So that completes today's video. I also did go ahead and stuff up. $250 into my wallet but I left that in my bank account um, and the reason why is I mentioned this in my last video is that we are currently using our credit card so that way we can get miles so that when we go on our next trip hopefully we can get at least one to two plane tickets for free that's kind of what we do when we're leading up to a trip we try to um, stop the cash flow a little bit and um use our credit card so that way we can hopefully get a plane ticket for free so that's kind of what's happening so that's why i'm not stuffing any cash into my wallet but i will be stuffing this miscellaneous ten dollars so i'll be doing that um but otherwise guys i can't wait to see y'all in my next video where it will be my first cash stuffing for the month of may so wow yeah i can't wait to see you guys then otherwise happy spring and i hope you guys are having an awesome time and i can't wait to see y'all in my next one Alrighty, bye